My honor and privilege to be here with Judy Firestone Singer, who is the development director for Matnat Chaim. Thanks for taking some time to talk. Thanks for having me. Uh, to start off, can you just tell us what Matnat Chaim does? Matnat Chaim is an Israeli nonprofit uh, which recruits and supports kidney donors, healthy kidney donors, who give kidneys to people who need transplants. Wonderful. I mean, I, I, I've, I've heard the numbers up to 500 now? Yes. Uh, in a couple of days, we will have our 500th transplant. Amazing. Uh, most, the vast majority of our donors do not know their recipients. Uh, all of them are, do it on a completely voluntary basis, and it's an amazing privilege to be able to take part. Amazing. Um, Israelis have ha traditionally had a very low rate of organ donations. Uh, why is that? Well. Um, partly, I think it's on religious grounds. There are debates among the Orthodox and ultra-Orthodox communities about time of death, which <clears throat> cardiac death versus brain death, and that uh, prevents many uh, Orthodox and ultra-Orthodox Jews from, they feel that they cannot uh, donate after their death. Um, and also, I think a lot of it is just cultural and, and even superstition. People who feel like well, you know, when the Messiah comes, I want to have all my parts, so I don't miss the whole, uh, all the excitement. Um, and it's not, it's not something, <clears throat> not something logical. It's just an emotional um, sort of antipathy to the idea of donating, and Israel has not had huge success in getting uh, organ donors to sign or donor cards uh, relative to other countries. Mm -hmm. How has this started to change in recent years? Well, um, <clears throat> two main things happened. First of all, uh, in 2008, the Knesset passed the transplant law, which uh, on the one hand stopped Israelis from going abroad to various uh, third world and other countries to get uh, transplants, many of which were not done in the most uh, legal and moral manner. Um, <clears throat> and the same law also gave certain incentives to people to do living donations. Um, they, people are now compensated for lost work days and transportation and uh, health insurance and various other things, which allows, um, which allows people to become living organ donors without losing money. That's thing number one that happened. Around the same time in 2009, uh, Matnat Chaim was founded. And this organization has actively recruited um, healthy volunteers to donate organs. And um, it's become a real success story. It's even, it's even a trend in Israel. People who have friends who have donated, they get interested. People who see one of our organization's publications or see a TV, something on the news, or um, it, it goes from, from word of mouth. and. Many, many, many people in Israel now know somebody who has uh, donated a kidney. And the, Israel is a, a very family-based society. Everybody knows everybody. And uh, the more people who know someone who has donated, the more likely they are to get interested and start uh, researching it themselves. And we've had uh, more and more donors. And, and this week, we'll be celebrating our 500th kidney transplant. Amazing. What are, what are some of the main incentives uh, that Israel's offering for, for living donation? And um, are those helping? I think they, it's not so much that the donations are um, caused by these incentives. Yeah. It's just when a person has decided they want to do this amazing mitzvah, yeah. this amazing good deed, um, they will not suffer any financial hardship mm -hmm. because their salary will be paid, mm -hmm. the transportation costs will be paid. This is a big thing in the States. Yeah. People are flying back and forth. Right. It's, it, it's often, there, there isn't always someone who will pay the, uh, the expenses and there's never someone who will pay their lost wages. Mm -hmm. And that's a big thing. Not everybody can afford to take a month off of work to, uh, to help somebody else out. Um, so the financial incentives will cover any losses that people may have. People get their life insurance paid for five years. They get their health insurance paid for five years, uh, which is a great thing. And also, um, both for signing a donor card and for uh, donating an organ, uh, being a living donor, uh, 
the donor and their entire immediate family, parents, children, and siblings, they all get bumped up on the list if they themselves ever need an organ. So if any of my kids, uh, God forbid, ever need a kidney or a heart or a liver, they will automatically go to the head of the line because of my donation, my children, my husband, and my siblings, mm -hmm. and my parents. Mm -hmm. um, so that's a big deal because many times when someone is considering donating a kidney, then people say to them, but what if one of your own kids needs one someday? And this legislation, which is very enlightened and very unique, um, has, has taken away a lot of the apprehension that people feel about, uh, about organ donation. And I think it's one of the big reasons why Israel is now the country which has the highest rate of altruistic kidney donation in the world. Mm. Um, and I really think that uh, our organization and this legislation can be models for other countries and other communities as they try to uh, understand how to help uh, kidney patients and people on dialysis. I, I, I'm blown away by the work you do. Uh, just incredibly inspiring to me. Um, learn more about the work of Matanat Chaim. If you look below, we're going to post a promotional video that, 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 talking a little bit about the work, uh, which Judy is actually in the video. Uh, and I'm also going to share two articles I wrote about how we might think about incentives here in the States. Uh, incentivizing as well, which uh, is not a black and white issue and how to think about, but to stimulate some, n some new thinking about how we might increase the number of lives we can save together. Keep up the amazing work. Thank you so Thank much. You so Pleasure much. to be here. Thank you.